Now, first, we got a couple things to talk about here. First of all, I, I missed yesterday's upload slot. It's my bad. Listen, this is what we're gonna do. I was originally gonna upload through Friday and then take Saturday off, but since I missed yesterday, we're gonna upload pack squads today and tomorrow, and you will get a Saturday pack squads since I messed up yesterday. That's my bad. Next, thank you guys in the comments for letting me know that Cattell Marte should be in right, Juan Soto should be in left. I was gonna switch that. I just, I, I put Cattell in left because I took JD out and Juan was already in right. I was gonna change it, but I, I appreciate y'all looking out for your boy. All right, so um, I'm kind of an idiot and I used Blake Snell off camera. So his energy's low, but it brought Kluber's energy back up. So I think I'm gonna use him again. Just rock him out two episodes in a row since he had a short start in the last one. Maybe use Otani out of the bullpen as a stick if we need to later in the game. Uh, we're gonna debut Ronald Acuna Jr. today. We're gonna put Glaber at second base. Um, we're gonna keep Jose Ramirez on the bench with Suarez. We took Yasmani off the bench because Garver's been smashing the ball. So we're gonna keep Garver in. Bench will be Donaldson, JD, Suarez, Olsen, and Ramirez. Infield, Devers, Story, Glaber, Pete. We could tell Ronald and Soto in the outfield. All right, we got Kluber versus Kluber, but he has Jimmy, Glaber, Yelich, Gary, 91 Bagwell, 92 Eddie, George Springer, and Granderson in the eight hole. All right, all right. He's got a record of 23 and 11. That spells beatable in my book. Let's go to work. Starts the game with a bleeder off the end of the bat with Jimmy Rollins. That's an extra base hit. Geese! Three pitches to Glaber. He can take a seat. Brings up Yelich. Fly ball out to center. Ronald's got a strong arm. Did not get behind that well, but J-Roll will stay at second. Two down now. Runner in scoring position for Gary Sanchez. Good sinker down and in. Away. Oh, Not only did Cattell, he got two bleeders on the inning to score the first run of the game. Ew. You want to talk about an undeserved run? That was a horrendous inning on his part. Two hits and a run to show for it. Let's match it. Cattell Marta, there we go. At least they matched a weird, hey, they gave me a weak hit to start the inning off. It's not an extra base hit, but I'll take it for now. Good pitch. We checked our swing. He said we went. Good timing. Good cutter down the way. That's a perfect cutter. All right, does it for the inning. We get one hit, no run. That Ronald Acuna check swing was uh, that was unfortunate. Good sinker up and in. Sit down, George. Another strikeout. There's two packs on the inning on K's. Brings up Kluber. Cut her up and away. Swings through it. Strikes out the side after the walk. We go to the bottom of the second. He's yet to put a good bat on a ball. Let's get a run. Devers, no doubt about it. We're tied. That's why he's staying in the lineup for now. Oh, ho, 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 ho. good timing on that. Just a hair on top. We ground out the shortstop. A little slurve out over the plate to Story. PCI is just a smidge down. That might be back-to-back -back homers. Yes! Four straight strikeouts for Kluber. Good front door cutter. Take a seat. Five straight strikeouts. Wow, strikes out the side two innings in a row. That's six Ks the last two innings alone. He hasn't touched the ball since the first inning. Scored on some nonsense. This guy's not ready for Hall of Fame. Not seeing Kluber well at all, who will lead off the third inning. Get down, Cattell. Give me extra bases. You owe me one. I'll take the single. Cattell Marte, again, I've been saying this the last couple episodes. He's a hit machine even if you miss the barrel. Checked our swing again, gets away. Runner will move up into scoring position with one out here, full count. Ball four. 
Saker up misses. Two on, one out for Soto. Whoa. It's a little off the end of the bat. There's nothing worse than having good timing and just missing it. You know as soon as you press the button that you were a hair from a home run. Misses. Another walk on the inning. Got a couple. We got a handful of packs this inning. Brings up Devers. I can't touch that cutter, man. Why did he run right by the ball? Dude. <laughs> Wait a minute. Trevor Story runs right by the ball. Four, six, three. Thank you. Way to make up for it. Yikes, I was going to be mad if he scored this inning. He did. That was a routine ground ball. Try and dot a fastball down and in. Lock him up. Lock him up. Take a seat. It's another strikeout for Kluber. We go to the bottom of the fourth. We got to turn on one here eventually. Fly ball out to center. And he finally hits the ball more than 96 feet. One down. Fly ball out to center. That was a hanger. He missed that one. That was a very hittable pitch. Two outs. There's a pack out, uh, strikeout for a pack to end the inning. We got Kluber top of the order coming up in the bottom of the fifth. It's 1-1. One, one. We both have three hits. He doesn't, hey, I'm not joking. He does not have one good swing the whole game. That one he does hit pretty well. All over, it'll go into the corner for extra bases. It'll be a double. Let's cash in. Ronald will step in. And he's going to get one to drop the other way. We're going to get three. That's going to score a run, and it'll be three. Yelich with his bad fielding. He doesn't get that. I'm going to send him. Go, Ronald. Run. Run, Ronald. Run. Two will score. Instead of just getting behind that ball, he tried to get, he tried, I don't know what he was doing there. I'll take that. A bleeder turns into a two run inside the park. Homer, is that a single and a three bag error? I don't even know what to call it, but we're up three one. There's our, well, there you go. Giving us our break back from the first inning. I'll take that. Perfect timing for it. Soto gets on top of a four seam, rolls at the first. We got two down here in the fifth. I'll take that. They owed us. Gonna take all the way here. Ball four, four pitch walk on Pete. There's, that's his second walk of the game. People are so scared of him. He walks more than anyone else on the team. He's gonna go to the bullpen again. It's Kenny Giles. Ball four, four pitch walk, two at bats in a row. Brings up Trevor Story. Pushed my PCI and I feel real bad about it. <laughs> we get two, top of the order coming up. We still got Kluber out there. We're gonna roll with him. Take a seat! Glaber steps in, he's over two with two Ks. Two-two slurve, swings over top. Another strikeout, that's two on the inning. Brings up Gary. Three oh, oh oh my gosh, this is unreal. Grant, oh my gosh, he swung 3-0 with two outs, and oh, and oh no, not smart. And that pitch was on the black too. Yikes, we go to the bottom of the six, let's win a frame. As if this hasn't been a frustrating enough game, I think we are in a freeze off right now. Lost connection. Lost connection, huh? We got the win. I was about to rage, dude. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, ratings up to 741. That was a weird game, man. Obviously, first game on Hall of Fame, Kluber versus Kluber is always going to be tough and low scoring. First inning was ugly. Ugly. I thought, I thought it was about to be one of those days that the game was just going to force our first loss on us. I thought that's what was about to happen. We're 17 and 0 in total. Um, not the most entertaining game. I was a little bit frustrated through that, throughout that one. But um, we scratch and clawed. Um, we took advantage of a mistake on his part in the field with uh, Christian Yelich. We went up three to one, and I, I don't know if he pulled the e-break there or 
or if that was a genuine disconnect, I don't know. All I know is his best two swings that entire game were two fly balls to center, and they were routine fly balls. So, I mean, he was just completely outmatched. Was not prepared for Kluber on Hall of Fame. Let's see how many packs we got. All right, we won the game. We had five hits, four walks, three runs. We had two homers. The Acuna, the Acuna play counted as an inside the park home run. One stolen base and 12 strikeouts with Corey Kluber. Are you kidding me? That's 20, that's 28 packs to open up and we get a second special pack for the rage quit. He couldn't touch Kluber. He really just couldn't touch him. Um, two out of his three hits were in the first inning and both of them were bleeders. Um, his next hit was another, was that, his next hit was that weird ground ball that snuck through that Trevor Story should have made a routine play on. So uh, honestly, he, Kluber, absolute gem. Absolute gem from Kluber. Zero hard contacts through seven innings or six innings of work in that one. Let's rip open these packs. All right, there will be two left over when we are done. Let's get it. Let's get a blue guy. Let's get a blue guy. Come on. David Dahl, let's get a blue guy. Come on, baby. Come on. Keep it going here. Bronze, okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. I gotta update the description box. There's a couple guys missing. Ahmed Rosario. Goal, Tommy Canley, there's a dupe. There's a dupe. Oh, we got diamond equipment. It's the same glove we already have equipped. At least it's worth 14,000 stubs, so I'll be able to sell it. There's value on the packs, at least. Take the value, but I would love, I would rather a diamond player, fam. It's crazy that that glove sells for some more than some diamond players. It's wild. It's insane, actually. Tommy Listella. 17 packs to go. Okay, we got another gold. Lance Lynn. All right. Gold equipment. Anything new? Batting gloves. 15 packs to go. Show me a diamond. Gold. Noah Syndergaard. There's another dupe. It's one of those golds that sells for a decent amount of subs, though. Zach Wheeler. Come on, baby. Oscar Mercado. 11 packs to go. All right, still nothing. Okay, let's keep it rolling. That's a more uh, diamond nameplate there. That's actually pretty dope. I might use that one. That's clean. Wow, this is rough. Seven more packs to go here, guys. Show me some blue. Double diamonds in the last episode. We double dipped. I have no idea how long my camera was just off. Hopefully we got a decent amount of the packs. Um, so far we've pulled a couple of golds, obviously. I, what, I probably, if I, my camera was off, I showed you guys the packs without the face cam. Um, but we got the diamond equipment that we already have equipped and that's it for the packs. Um, so nothing crazy out of the packs today, but um, I do have that equipment that we can sell, which is pretty dope. Let's go to the gloves. This, this glove is selling for crazy. I mean, this sells for more than some diamond players. I'll take 18K for that, Captain. All right, that's gonna do it for today's episode. A little bit of a frustrating episode. Um, you know, first game on Hall of Fame, Kluber versus Kluber, like I said, gonna be a low scoring affair. Uh, most times, they're not. Devers though, I'm telling you, Devers is an absolute monster. Use him if you're not already. We are still undefeated, 11 and 0 on pack squads. Um, 6-0 with my main squad, 17-0 overall in ranked seasons as we make our way towards championship series. And then our World Series is the next step after that. So we're going to keep the grind going, looking for championship series in the next episode. If you guys are looking forward to that, hit that thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you are new. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Yes, did you hear all that fuzziness? That's right. My mic took a dump. My mic took a dump on me today. So I'm gonna have to do a voiceover, but that's okay. We're gonna have some fun with it. We're back with another pack and play. In this pack and play, we're gonna get, play against my guy, Samuel Adams. The link to his YouTube and his Twitch are in the description box down below. Sam is one of the best players in the community. He's an absolute savage. Rips off 12 OBRs like it's nothing. Still undefeated and ranked. You definitely wanna check him out. 
go sub to his YouTube, follow him on Twitch and the link down below. Now, if you're new to the Pack and Play series, we're gonna rip a